Paris, Ohio. Say Paris, Ohio. And what you find? The Mac, more, Moran. I don't, more iron, tombstone, and a lot of people can't find it. Scoot yeah. over a little bit, honey. Okay. Um, I can't get, this thing's focusing like a, okay. Okay. So we're in St. Paris tonight, and we've come to find the glowing tombstone that is reported in the cemetery. Um, and the internet it said thousands of people have come into this um, cemetery looking for this tombstone to see if it glowed, and a lot of people couldn't find it. Yeah. But it, we had Bear come out, and Bear found it for us. Yeah, it said uh, in one night there was a thousand people trying to get a glimpse of it now I read somewhere on the internet so I don't know if I'm gonna put the link but it's been a while back to where they said uh, people couldn't find it we was here what five or ten minutes yeah and what happened and dad said check that I said look at that one and dad said go over there and check it so I came around I was like uh-uh I just found it he's like nah -uh. I was <laughs> like, yeah look and I showed him it yeah so we noticed um there's a couple spots on it that look like it's glowing, and in the night vision, I think it shows black. Yes, it does. You're um, right. But it's on all sides. It's so on all four sides of it. We're not real sure because if you, I don't know if you can tell, we're standing under a lot of trees, so there's really no light coming in from the moon or anything to show you that there would be any reflection. So. Um, not quite sure what's going on with it. Kind of interesting. Yeah, it is. Yeah, we're not sure, but as paranormal investigators, that's why we're not ghost hunters. We're investigators. we got to investigate things and, you know, find out, try to find out answers, see what's going on, because we're not ghost hunters, because we don't always just hunt for ghosts. We investigate, and uh, we also, you know... Paranormal, anything paranormal, Bigfoot, uh, swamp monsters, UFOs, whatever. We do it all, don't we, girls? We sure yeah. do. So, what do you think? On to the next? Yes, we're going to yeah. go to two more places tonight and see if we can get them up later for you. Yeah, we'll where, tell you the stories there. Where are we going? This we'll, we'll make this one video, but where are we going next? Uh, Trestle Road Bridge. Yeah. It's a railroad bridge. So what happened there? I'm shaking. I'm sorry. I'm cold. So, um, And this thing focuses. But what happened there? A girl was cro might have been crossing the railroad tracks, and a train was coming. She either had to jump or get hit by the train, and she got hit by the train on the tracks. Yeah. Now, we will put a link to that in the description below. Yeah. So, so the description below, we'll put a link to that, and also to where we're at now which is uh, Evergreen Cemetery in St. Paris, Ohio. It's in Champaign County. And then where else are we going after that, Pooh Bear? Uh, Lonesome Road. That's right. What happens there? Um, it's claimed that a man comes out of the road and he um, doesn't like people driving through his property because his property was taken by the government a long time ago to make the road. So now he stands in the road and tries to stop people from driving onto his property. Yeah. So that's going to be our third stop tonight. Yes. And, and he go ahead. also has red eyes. He also hits the car. Um, he stands in the middle of the road to make you stop and stop. So yeah. it's going to be interesting to see what we find out there. And uh, uh, this, w uh, this cemetery, just a little tidbit here, was established in 1900. So... All right, girls, ready? Yeah. Ready to go to the next one? On yes. to the next. All right, we're going to go. To, we don't know the rights to that, by the way, and we are by no means affiliated with, I'm going to say it, TAP, sue me. Because <laughs> they always say that. Oh. Remember? Yeah, I At didn't the end, think they always, <laughs> on to the next. Well, right. we're, we're not on to the next. We're on an adventure, so. But we're going to go to the trestle and, um, We'll get back with you, and we'll see what happens there. We did bring some equipment with us, didn't we, girls? Yes, we did. For the train trestle? Mm -hmm. Ghost box. What else? A ghost uh, meter pro. Flashlights. Yes. 
We totally need those at start. Yes, and... And also, um, a recorder. And we brought a voice recorder, that's right. And, of course, the night vision Two camera cameras. I'm... Yeah, the night vision camera I'm using right now, and our regular camera, the good one. But it's not night vision, so... All right, you girls ready? Yep, yep. That's All good. right, we'll talk at you in a few. Bye. Bye.